Hello and welcome to Family Affairs. I'm your host, Hannah Lamass, and today we'll be discussing the marital difficulties of Texas-born newlyweds, Zach and Jennifer. Jennifer wants Zach to commit to her properly in light of her pregnancy, but Zach denies claims of adultery and says he will not offer his support to her until she takes a paternity test. Here to introduce the couple and to offer them support throughout the show is their longtime friend, Essen Geller. We've been close ever since we were young. Zach is my favourite bowling buddy and gym bro. I love these two guys. They've had their ups and downs, but they're made for each other. I believe they can get through this, and Zach will step up to the mark and be a great father to their baby. So Jennifer and Zach, why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself and what brings you here to Family Affairs? Well, first off, hi Hannah. Me and Zach, we've been together six years. We're high school sweethearts. We got married three weeks ago in Greece and that was all swell but then things ain't been good lately and and I know he's cheating on me. What makes you so sure? Do you have any evidence? I found Grinder on his phone, Tinder too and Instagram. He scrolls through that like crazy looking at girls photos. Mm -hmm. uh, he's been out late every single night. He says he's bowling. I don't believe that for a second. Well, Zach, do you have anything to say in response to that? That's a load of bullshit. I ain't been cheating on you. And you know that was my cousin Bobby's phone I bought off him. They had the apps already installed on him. What are you talking about? I don't use Grinder. I know my cousin's gay, but you can't t hold that against him. Well, Jennifer, to complicate matters, you're expecting a baby, aren't you? Yes, I'm two months pregnant now, and it's, it's a scary thing. It's my first baby. I didn't intend to get pregnant. I know for sure it's Zach's. And... Like, for example, I've been getting all kinds of weird cravings, like pickles and tuna sandwiches and two in the morning. It's just a scary, scary experience. Zach, how do you feel about everything? Well, she says the kid's mine, but I think she's the one who's sleeping around, not me. I think you've been cheating on me while I'm off bowling, while I'm off going to the gym. And how can you be so sure? Well, I'll tell you why I'm sure, because I got a doctor's note and I'm infertile. That is forged. Look at that, that thing. Ain't I don't forged. believe it for what a second. That ain't forged. What are you talking about? Well, actually, Jennifer, we have consulted with our resident medical professional, and he can support these claims. I am a doctor, and I, 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 I can't with 100% uh, certainty that I, I can't say that Zach shoots blanks. He, he, he can't fertilize. He can't. So the question remains, who is the father? Earlier, Jennifer took a paternity test, and the results are in. Hello? Mm-hmm. Yes, I see. Thank you. The father is, in fact, someone near and dear to the both of you. And he's here today, backstage. It's Essen Geller! What the fuck? Come on out, Essen! Essen? God damn! Your own cousin? This is majorly fucked up. Jennifer, how did this happen? Well, you have no idea how hard my life has been. I dropped out of school at 13. I have a terrible job. My life is awful. And I just... And things have been bad with you, too. I just wanted some comfort, and I'm... I'm real close to my cousin, and, you know, one thing led to another. It's not we're really, we're only first cousins. Zach, this must come as quite a shock to you. Life's been tough for you, bitch, get a hobby, don't fuck your cousin. What the fuck is wrong with you? God damn. Like, I fucked my second cousin one time, but she was my second cousin. Ain't my first cousin. That's sick. That's sacrilege. Essen? Don't act like we haven't engaged in a post-workout coitus, either. You what? You yeah. fucked my cousin too? What the fuck is wrong with yeah. you? He's a man! God damn, that's why you gonna, gonna say that now. Is that, that true? It's, it's what true. the fuck? You been, you been fucking her, you been fucking him, yeah, what are you talking about? Yeah, he's a man and you a man. Alright, calm it's down 2018. Now. I want to hear how you feel, you've just heard that you're going to be a father. I'm not ready at all, like I, I did not expect this to happen, so I'm, I'm not ready to take the, the responsibility for the kid. 
Man, this is this is so fucked up. Essen, you're my you're my best friend, man. We've been we've been friends for what fifteen years? You're my gym buddy? My bowling buddy? My fuck buddy? God damn and, and Jennifer, you're you've been my wife for three weeks. We had a great time in Greece. I can't believe this. But you know what, Jennifer, you're the only woman I ever loved. And Essen, you're the best friend I ever had. So, I, I think I'm going to ha Hannah. I'm going to have to step up to the plate here and, and take care of this baby, even though it's not mine. And I, I think Essen, I, I, I want, I still want us to be friends, and I want you to be part of my life. And and Jennifer, I love you, and I want to be here for you. I was just wrong, guys. Like I, I'd love to support any sort of any sport you need. I'll be there for you. Let's go ahead as a triad. Yeah, yes, and I, I want that to happen too. I love you, man. I love you, I love you honey. I love you too. Well, there you have it, folks. Modern love, I suppose. Join us next time. I've been your host, Hannah Lamass, and this has been Family Affairs. If you have any information or any opinions on what you've seen here today, do drop us a line, but send us some money first so we can buy a computer. Thanks now. See you next time.